All right, guys, I'm going to start uh, sanding on this hood so I can buff it. Um, I'll show you guys how I do it. Uh, I'm going to start with 1500 grit. I got a bucket of soapy water. I'm just going to put it on here and start sanding. I'm going to show you what I do. All right, so I got my block with my 1500 grit and my bucket of water right below here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get my bucket. I'm going to dip my sandpaper in there. I'm going to get some water on here. And then I'm going to start sanding. I typically like to start in a little circle. Do a circle and go back and forth in an X pattern. Just go in a bunch of different directions. And you can feel it sanding. Once it starts getting kind of harder to sand, you can see all the dust getting up in the water. You can squeegee it. You can see the orange peel here on the ends. It is kind of peely. Um, you can see it's nice and smooth right here. And you see it's peely here still. You want to sand it until it's nice and smooth like this. And you see some dirt particles here. You want to sand that until it's smooth. But basically you want to sand the whole entire hood until it's nice and smooth like this. And they're good to buff. So you got to get to going on the rest of the hood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
so now that all the wet sanding on the Bronco was done, I'm officially ready to start buffing. Um, here in the back of the side-by-side -side is what all I use for my buffing. Uh, I got my DeWalt buffer here, and all my products I'm using is 3M. I'm using the 3M compound and polish. The one and two step works great. Um, I'll be using the compound, the white bottles with these two. This will be my first step. It's the, the coarser wool pad. And the second yellow one is a finer wool pad. And then finally, I'll use the polish with the foam pad on the end. This actually isn't a 3M product. They didn't have what I needed at my local paint store at the time. So I went to Summit Racing and got a foam pad. It works fantastic. Plus it's a third of the price. So I went ahead and used that and it works great. So without further ado, let's get to shining this thing. going great until it wasn't uh, for some odd reason I was buffing this corner now I was doing it right I was rolling the buffer pad off of this edge not digging into it it just grabbed weird and now I have a lovely burn on the front of this fender so whenever I paint my new bumper that I'm gonna get I gotta paint a fender so all that hard work of sanding the whole fender flat and buffing it was a huge waste of time. Now of course it wasn't on the first step or second step, it was on the last step with the foam pad. You see this thing's all kind of chewed up now. Just It just grabs so weird. No idea. I did the other side, it was just fine. Did Bailey's, it was just fine. Did this one, it was just fine. A million other jobs. Of course, I don't burn until uh, I'm on camera and have to record literally everything. I didn't even want to show this. But trying to keep it as real as possible, I guess. But other than that, it came out great. I just kind of ruined my day. I want to just burn this whole truck down now, but... Other than that, it looks good. Well, I guess I'll do it for now. <laughs> 